Welcome everybody. Supreme Family Garden here. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Don't you do that today. It's Friday. We're gonna have a good hand clapping, toe time, good day today. Now I'm wondering who you're talking to over there, because I'm usually behind the camera. But when you come <laughs> on over there. Introduce the camera girl. That's my beautiful daughter holding the camera, crafted by Kiki. <laughs> Give me your information, baby. Oh yeah, so. Hi guys, it is Kiki here, and I'm just taking over the Supreme Family's uh, camera right now. I just wanted to tell you guys again about my business. It is crafted by Kiki, that is crafted with the K in Kiki, K-I-K-I. I do have a YouTube channel as well, so definitely check me out on YouTube. Check me out on Instagram and Facebook for my food truck locations. On my YouTube, I talk about travel, I do some cooking videos, and just day in the life of a food truck entrepreneur. So definitely check out my content if you guys are interested, and stay blessed, stay safe. All right, look at this, folks. If you guys ever wondered what is that white film that's always on our food, I'm about to show you. Now this pumpkin has been out here for about three weeks, okay? Same thing here. This is the chemical that they're putting on this, I guess, to preserve it, to keep them through shipping, handling, and all of that. But this is why, in my opinion, look at this avocado. Look. Folks, we gotta do better. And this label says that these are organic. Now, I've showed you guys this before where I take it and I throw it, all right? Now, we gonna do it. Now, look at how mushy this is. See, it doesn't matter to me, guys, because I use it for fertilizer, okay? But I'm gonna show you. Watch me, baby. Ew. You see how that only broke up like that? Now, the same for this. You notice how the top of that did not split open because it's being bonded by that chemical that they're using to quote unquote preserve our foods. Garbage. Now look at here. This has been out here for well, easy months since we've done the last video. Now this is. <laughs> oh, is that a cabbage, red cabbage? Yeah, baby. Look. Rubbery. Yeah, you know. And this has been out in Central Florida's hot it's weather. Though. Yeah, it was real pretty. <laughs> but who would want to feed their young and or themselves something like this? What does that look like to you, Kiki? Like cabbage. No, but look at the fill it and tell Red me what cabbage. it is. It feels rubbery, mm -hmm. honestly. Yeah. Sir? You had oh, to yeah. touch. Uh huh. <laughs> okay, now over here. Where is that? Oh, you're stepping on it, baby. Oh. Ew. That's been out here for about three months. This is a cantaloupe. Ew. Look ew. at this. <laughs> it's flat like Say that. it with me, guys. Cantaloupe. Yeah. Folks, that doesn't make any, any sense. Look. Look at that. That's cantaloupe. Ten dollars to eat it. Yep. So you you're gonna yeah you're gonna spend ten bucks to kill you, yourself. <laughs> if my daughter wasn't here, I was gonna say something then, but I'm gonna I'll keep it to myself. You to eat it for ten bucks. <laughs> All right. Now, I know a lot of you guys are wondering, what is the Supreme that they're using? Oh, I'm about to show you today. Mm-hmm. Now again, how I use that stuff. Nothing but fertilizer because it's given to me about thousands of pounds a week for free. Look at this. There's that white film. What's that, baby? That's called green a green bean. Mm -hmm. Now look, folks. You heard that pop. Not a snap now. Look. This is why we're getting cancer and you name it. 
it doesn't even break down. <laughs> That's the sad part about it. It doesn't break down. Okay, over here. All right, look at here. You know what this is, Kiki? What does that look like? Is it a watermelon? You. <laughs> that still yeah. holds together because of that film that they're using on our foods. Look at that. Yummy. Look at all this. These are all watermelon out in Central Florida, and it's still been 80 degrees every day. Cantaloupe again. Folks, this stuff is only good for fertilizer. Look, folks, look. What does that look like, baby? It's like stretchy. This is food, folks. <laughs> this is food. This is food. This, baby, it's... Because I never really play with it like this. I'm playing with it today. Yeah. Throw it around my tree. Oh, here's an apple. The squirrels only ate some of it. God damn, that tell you enough. And again, it's been out here for weeks. Now, if the sun, Mother Nature can't break this stuff down, our bodies definitely can't. Then you go to the doctor and they're going to say, well, what's wrong with my baby doc? Well, he has a new strand of cancer. They got a new strand because you got a new strand of poison that you're feeding our children with. Come on, we're gonna get to the nitty gritty now. Come on, now that you're gonna be the doctor. Now, folks, this is fresher stuff that I dropped out. You know what that is, baby? A watermelon? Yep, now look. See, there's that white film again, okay? So when they tell you guys, oh, you have to wash it with baking soda, folks, you can't wash this stuff off. It goes down into it. Like, look, it seeps down once they wash it, polish it, whatever they're going to do through those conveyor belts, it goes into the skin. If it's anything the way the God I serve, the biggest organism tissue is your skin, right, baby? Yes. So common sense tells me it has to be the same way with the fruit. The biggest organ. You know what I'm you trying. Y'all know what I'm trying to <laughs> say. Work a, with my you said a word there. <laughs> I'm don't, not even going to repeat the word you said. Don't me what I said now. Baby, don't do that, Jimmy. That's why I'm out here growing you your food. And I have to play with this stuff. Maybe that's why I've been constipated. Ooh. I'm eating this bad stuff. All right, folks. Too many wings. Now, there we go. This, yeah. Some store-bought stuff. This is fresh. Let the doctor get ready. What we have here today. Stay close, babies, because I don't have my microphone so the nice people can see what we got in the house. These are some strawberries. Show the table. These are everyday fruit. Some, some, because these aren't food right here, babe. Well, baby, they got common sense now. Well, if they that them. slow now, they, they ain't going to help them anyway. He, he doesn't mean that. Just the truth. The school teacher said it. Now, folks, look at these strawberries. Now, you heard the pack open. Pineberry. Are they supposed to be white, babe? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, look. Folks, look now. Now, I'm pulling. Now, Look, folks. These are your strawberries now. There's that old white film again. <laughs> okay, now here we go. You know what that is, darling? A bell pepper. That's right. You can't see it. See that? Now look at it, right? Now, but what does that outer layer look like it's to you? Waxy, shiny. It looks waxy. You know why? Because this is what they use. Carnival wax. Uh, Another wax starts with These the P. Wax? Yep, they also use this. And it's another oil that they use. So for all you vegetable, vegetable, oil. vegetable oil. oil, okay? So for people who say, well, I don't eat fried foods and I don't like the grease, you're still getting it by not growing your own food. So it doesn't make a difference. You don't believe what I'm saying. Google it. And again, give us a thumbs up, hype the video, share this with the world, okay? Now I'm gonna show. This is a papaya. Right out of the store. Check me out. I'm gonna show you guys my papaya in a second. Now this is an aloe, okay? You see that same waxy residue? Take a look now. Now I'm gonna bend Scrape this. With your finger. I'm gonna bend it. Look at that. Doesn't even want to tear. 
All right, now we're gonna stay right here, okay? Come on, baby, let's go to one of my aloe plants. Come on, honey, you gotta get up today. Don't step in that hole, baby. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, daddy, put the tree down. They almost <laughs> killed me. <laughs> All right, come on. And remember, young ladies, when that fella says, I want to date you, you need to say, do you know how to grow anything? If he tells you no, run. <laughs> See, my baby got a good Darius, a Darian. She got a good boyfriend. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> now, look at here now. Now, watch mine. Look at that lady. Well, y'all can see the difference. See, now watch me, watch me, y'all. Watch now. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Look how juicy and slimy and wet and gooey. Look at that now. But it's right off the tree. We gonna do it again. I'll take this all over my skin. Mm-hmm. You can, baby. It's, it's a bunch of them in the back. See that? Look at that. Now bring it on up now. See it keep you healthy. Go ahead, chill. Fire <laughs> Yeah, keep me healthy. I want to be handsome when I get 87. <laughs> See the difference, folks. See the difference. No rubbery effect. Okay, come on back. All right. Remember this line. Come on. Come on to the table, baby. Table of truth. So we're worrying about the wars and all of this stuff, but they're killing us with the food. So the war is actually with us. If they really want to, what's that baby, they get rid of the people of population control, then they can do it through the food. Because they're going to put everything else on the television so we can watch it, but then they're injecting all of this garbage into our food, right? Supremes, the stores. Which one shines the most? Oh, it would be this one, right? Now let's watch <laughs> this. Put me a little beeswax. Oh, you gonna waste my lemon? No, you can eat it. Just like the now rest of them. The, now with oh, the beeswax. beeswax oh yeah, hair. but it's in, it's in there. I'm gonna polish it up good too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now we gonna make them look the same. All right. All right. I mean, they got a shot. It smells good, though. <laughs> hey, well, they got the same. They look about the same, don't they, baby? Mm -hmm. They look sure about do. the same. Which one is yours again? That's <laughs> See, this is ours. Big one. Yeah. Okay, but now here's the test. See, one, boom. Theirs. Mine, theirs. Shit, I can't even get in it. <laughs> I can't even open it. Folks, look. I can't even get it open. That's because when they wash them, this is one of the products that they use, okay? What is it? A uh, vegetable wash? What? Yeah, I'll it's read a it. vegetable wash. It and, is. Anti-microbial fruit and vegetable wash. I don't have my glasses on. Read it to the people, baby. Hold on, there we go. Read now. There you go. Now you think about it, you're supposed to mix this one to 1,000, okay? But we know nowadays most kids can't read on or below their grade level. It's the truth, folks. So these are gonna be the same kids <laughs> that are gonna work in the store that has to mix this mess to feed us. Not the store, the factory, wherever they- put The their store, well, you know, this same thing. They always have something to say. They know what I'm trying to say. Let me get it all out. I mess up my delivery rate of it. So you think about it. They done, what, what the kids do to vape, they done vape and came back in there. They want to go to the club that night. Now they done pour half of this in there on all of our food, right? And then we got to eat stuff that looks like this. Unopened blueberries. There you go, folks. Can't get no more proof, no more better than this. So for those of you who want to go out and buy some blueberries, go buy the blueberry plant. Don't go buy your son the Michael Jordans and all that. Go buy him a blueberry tree if this is what he likes. And get him some pro wings or some U.S. polo shoes and something. But he'll be healthy and strong like old Supreme here. Hold on, folks. I'm going to throw that right out there. That's all it's good for. Asparagus spears. Here we go. Now, these are fresh. Got the label on them. Look at here. 
take the rubber band off. Yeah, this is what you're like. Look at this. Asparagus steak, boy, it's a good meal, right? Yeah, that does sound good. It does, doesn't it, baby? Mm -hmm. Not these kind, though. Mm -hmm. I'm a grower, so now look. Rubber. Your brain is telling you you're eating asparagus. That's why when you poop, it coming out all hard. It ain't like it used to be. No, it's no good. Couple oranges, right? Apple, look at that. Baby, that's shining. This one here got carnauba wax. I would have bought right? that one in the store because it's pretty. Yeah, it that's shiny right. and it's pretty. It's pretty yeah. like you. But this will yeah. kill you, though, folks. Okay, this will this kill you. Look at that. It's no prettier than that. It's flawless. Let's think about it for a second, right? And they, hold on, they do that to kind of because they entice people, people eat to buy. With your eyes. That's right. So they entice it. You know, whatever they put on there for you to look, and it looks so good and healthy. And you think it's an apple is healthy. Mm -hmm. and you're eating it. Yeah. I want the one that got a few spots on it. That way, I know the chemical did. This thing doesn't have a spot on it. By nature, it's not supposed to. Let's go to a fruit tree. I'm going to teach those of you novice on how this works. All right. Just so you guys can have a better understanding, follow that it is. We're gonna pretend, right, that all of this is an orange orchard, okay? And we have to pay someone to come out here and pick these fruit. Do you really think I'm gonna pay them three times to come out here? No, I'm not. Look at here. This one's gonna look like this. That one looks like this. That one's not ready. You understand where I'm going with it? So they all look different. They all look different. They're not gonna ripen at the same time. So what they're gonna do, they're gonna spray this chemical on these babies to induce them. And Leroy's gonna go out there, hectoring all of them and spring, pick them, put them in bushels, run them down the conveyor belt, get a bunch of wax on them, and they're gonna sell them to us. That's what they're doing, folks. So again, income tax is coming, Christmas is coming, those of you who are having a newborn baby, instead of getting a bunch of flowers, tell your mother, buy that's a good tree, baby, that's good. Peace tree, plum tree, nectarine tree, whatever it may be, and plant it in the yard for your child. You will have a strong, successful little boy because his mind is going to be free from all these toxins. Supreme Family Garden, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. I like it. By telling y'all all this good stuff. May God bless each and every one of you. Thank you for watching. Give it a thumbs up before you click off this video. Please like, share, and subscribe yeah, to the channel. Send it to all your people so we all can be healthy. <laughs>